this exhausted at work. Maybe I have and I just don't remember, but I'm so freaking tired this morning and I don't want to be here. It's going to be a busy day. I had 52 emails when I came in and uh, like nine loans, so I'll be busy for a while and that's okay. Maybe keep me distracted or something throughout the day. Today's a neat day. So for breakfast, I brought bread and hard boiled eggs, so I'll make toast and eggs. And then for lunch, I brought the leftover steak I had from the other night and um, just some random stuff. I didn't want it to go to waste and what I was going to bring for lunch has a lot more calories than what I would want to eat for lunch, which was some tamales. So Anyway, I'm going to go get to work and I will talk to you guys in a little bit. I am not going to lie, I'm really surprised that I made it through that whole day without dying because I was so tired and I wanted to go home so badly. But I did it and I made it and it was super busy. I had so much work to do um, and I'm going to have a lot to do tomorrow too probably. It seems like it keeps coming in spurts now where it's busy and then it's not and it's busy and it's not. But I'm hoping that it will start being just purely busy for that overtime if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> so yeah, today was a busy day. I'm home, obviously, and I'm getting ready to go inside. I'm gonna walk Bowser, change, give it a couple minutes so he's out of his cage for a little bit, and then walk over to the gym thing and run for a little bit. I'm gonna try to use that app today. I think I got the sound to start working on it now, so I'm gonna try that. And um, after that, Ian's gonna come over. I think we found a house that we really wanna rent. So um, we're gonna wanna put in our application tonight or tomorrow, more than likely tomorrow, um, once we get both of them in and stuff like that. We really like it. And we're gonna also look at another house that's a little further away, um, just for another option, basically. But yeah, super excited to do that. Um, this house is the one that I've really liked for a while and I really want, so. Hopefully if everything works out, it's the one we'll get and that'd be freaking great. <laughs> for lunch, I had my leftovers and a yogurt. And then on the way home, I just had an apple so that way I'll be kind of nourished enough for uh, the run. And I also had a piece of chocolate earlier today, but I mean, that's no big deal. I'm gonna get off here, go inside, get ready to go run, run, do the rest of the stuff I told you about. I don't know what I'm gonna do for dinner yet. I might just have a pizza for my freezer. Um, quick and easy that way, you know, I'm not having to cook anything. And uh, I really don't want to cook right now, so that's probably what I'll do. But I'll talk to you guys in a little bit. Well, it is bedtime for me, um, sort of. I am waiting for this stupid computer to work so I can apply for this home that Ian and I are going to hopefully get. So, um, yeah, my computer's not working though, and it's being dumb. So I kind of want to throw it across the room right now. For dinner, I ended up having pizza from the fridge like I said earlier and then I ended up having a little bit of ice cream a little bit ago uh, because I have quite a few calories left over for the rest of the days or had quite a few calories left over for the rest of the day I wasn't too hungry today though which is kind of weird so that's probably why but anyway I'm gonna go to bed and I will talk to you guys in the morning hopefully I can get this stupid application to work <laughs> I'm so tired I don't want to be here it's Tuesday which you guys know is my least favorite day of the week so that kind of sucks. Today's a fasting day, so I won't be eating. I have a lot of work again to do today, so I'll be busy most of the day focusing on that stuff. But I'm also super excited and anxious to hear back about it if we got this house or not. So that'll be on my mind, but I gotta try to focus on all the work I have to do too, which is gonna be kind of hard. So we'll see how this day goes. I'm gonna go get to it, and I'll see you guys in a little bit. Just driving home, I got so tired, I wanted to fall asleep. <laughs> <sighs> yeah, this was a really long day. It seems like the clock never changed and I am so freaking glad that I'm home now. So I'm gonna go inside and um, look through a closet to see if I can get rid of anything, condense some stuff. Um, I haven't heard back on the house yet. I'm really anxious and I really wanna know if we got it because I want this house really bad. Um, but yeah. I won't know about that for a little bit, probably. Not really too much to report from today. I didn't eat anything. I just stuck with my coffee and water. So that's good. But yeah, like I said, I'm really tired. So I'm gonna kind of chill tonight. I don't have to go anywhere, which is nice. So I'll stay home and relax a little bit. Did you just see that guy pass by me? <laughs> yeah, anyway, I'm gonna let you guys go and uh, go get to my evening. Probably have hot chocolate at some point. Maybe not though, probably, yeah. <laughs> well, 
I watched The Greatest Showman, had a cup of hot chocolate, went through a closet, and now I have nothing else to get rid of. So this is all what's moving with me that's in this apartment right now anyway. Maybe I'll go through it again or when I'm packing, find some things to get rid of. I don't know. It's time for bed though. It's like 8.45, so I'm gonna go get in it and uh, hopefully sleep and all that good stuff. I'm really tired, but when aren't I? So, you know. Anyway, I'll talk to you guys tomorrow morning. Happy Wednesday, everybody. It's a neat day. For breakfast, I'm having eggs and toast. For lunch, I brought tamales. Whenever I looked at them the other day, I thought they had a lot more calories in them than they did, but one serving is only 240, so two of them is 480, and that's like 30 calories over my calorie count for lunch, so not that big of a deal, and I might not even eat both of them. I don't know. I also brought a yogurt, some cheese sticks, and some chips, but I haven't really been too hungry on my eat days lately, so I haven't been eating everything that I brought, so we'll see if I eat all of it. It's gonna be 75 today, I think, which is really freaking nice and I'm super excited for it. I even wore a dress with no tights. That's been a first in a really, really, really long time. <laughs> I'm gonna go get to work, I have a lot to do, but I'll talk to you guys later. So, I actually got home quite a bit earlier today because somebody's gonna come and give Bowser a pet interview for the house that we applied for. And um, I don't really know what all that entails, but I'm kind of nervous and it's eating me up inside because Bowser likes to bark at people he doesn't know and he's very timid and I'm afraid that they might look at that and think he's a mean dog because of that. But I don't know, both my mom and Ian say that he's gonna be fine and it's no big deal, but we'll see in about 50 minutes what they think, so. Yeah, besides that, we got that house. Um, I signed my part of the lease already. Ian just has to go through his and we got paid the deposit and we will be moving in May 4th. So I'm super excited. I'm so ready to move into a house and um, that is exciting in my life. Right now, I am heating up some tamales in my microwave for lunch. I didn't get a chance to eat before I left work, so I mean that. And then for breakfast, I had the eggs and toast and I also had a serving of the multigrain chips. So, that's all I've had to eat so far today, as far as I remember. And uh, I'm going to get up here so I can clean my apartment real quick before this lady gets here. And I will talk to you guys in a little bit. So, I decided not to go running tonight because I am really tired. And I'm probably going to regret that later. Maybe I'll do it tomorrow. Uh, see what it's like to run on a fasting day. So that way I can kind of get caught back up on running. But I don't know yet if that's a good idea. So we'll see how I'm feeling tomorrow. I am in the process of making dinner. It's a green chicken chili casserole recipe. I'll show you guys what it looks like here in a couple minutes. It's almost done. I'm going to watch a series of unfortunate events. I'm really tired. I don't want to do anything. But I might pull out a canvas and draw a painting. Probably not. Probably not. Pet inspection went really well for Bowser, which I was kind of surprised because he's kind of timid around people he doesn't know, but he was good, so that's great. Um, basically, I'm just waiting on the okay from Ian to move forward with the house. Some issues there on that, but I think it'll work out fine. I hope it does anyways. I'm gonna go watch this show. I don't think I ate anything else today besides the chips. I did have a couple of corn nuggets my mom brought over and right now I'm drinking a Michelob Ultra light beer. <laughs> I never had the yogurt that I was planning on having earlier so I put that back in the fridge of course and I'll have that tomorrow maybe if I decide to run. Maybe not. Probably not. <laughs> Seems like the food's done so I'm gonna go check on it and I'll be right back. All right the casserole is done. I've never made this recipe before so I'm kind of intrigued. Uh, it's cauliflower, salsa verde, salt, pepper, sour cream, cream cheese, and cheese. I think that's everything. I'm going to scoop this up, let it cool down a little bit, eat it, let you guys know how it tastes a little later on today. Well, the casserole actually turned out really well, and I'm pretty happy with it. I mean, filling, definitely. I had way too much, and I shouldn't have eaten that much, but I did. I had one three-fourths cup servings which was 544 calories, which isn't terrible. I still have 64 calories left, but I'm not gonna be eating anything else for the rest of the day. It's almost eight o'clock. As you can hear Bowser over there chomping away on this food. I'm gonna finish up this episode of Lemony Snicket and then I'm gonna get ready for bed. But I wanted to go ahead and close out this week's vlog. So thanks guys for stopping by again. I have 
quite a few new subscribers, so that's really exciting. I think last time I checked, I had 60, which I never expected to get 50 or 40 for that matter. So thank you so much for stopping by and watching if you're new here. I really appreciate it. I'm gonna get off here and finish up the rest of my evening. So thanks guys for stopping by. I really appreciate it and I will catch you on the next vlog.